I'm the perpetually peckish peckery. That's how you say your name? Hello everyone. <laughs> Are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Woki, and I'm back with another Dragalia Lost video. Today I'm gonna be summoning a little bit for Princess Connect Redive. Now, are any of these characters amazing? As far as I can tell, not the most amazing in the world, but I really like the look of them, so I kinda wanna try for them at least. So that's gonna be today's video. I hope you like it. Um, if you do, remember to leave a like. It does help a whole bunch. I have noticed that I think less people have been watching summon videos, and I have a feeling it's because you want to summon less in Dragalia now. So if you wanna throw me a bone for you know, you can live vicariously through me. You can avoid doing the bad thing of summoning by just looking at me summon. Um, so you can leave a like to help me out a whole bunch. Um, subscribe to me if you want some more uh, gotcha stuff and me videos in general. Pecoron, I swear to God, stop coming into the video. And finally, um, comment. Do all that good stuff. Tell me if you're summoning if you did. Tell me how you did. All that good stuff. So let's dive into it right away. So... Here's the thing, because I'm almost positive I'm going to get comments about it immediately. I am aware of the, um, um, of the stuff that was found in the data mines. Uh, I'm not going to say much, just because in, in case there's people who don't want to know the future characters that might be coming to the game, or maybe who might not be coming to the game. Um, I'm gonna avoid saying it, and if you can actually, you know, do me a solid and not say them in the comments, that'd be nice. You know, just in case there's people who want to be genuinely surprised when it happens. I am gonna be making a video of talking about it specifically, so, um, we'll kind of focus all that chat on there. But I will say, seeing those names in that list does make me want to summon on this a little bit less. So I'm not gonna be doing too much, I'm just gonna be doing a couple. Um... Not, not too much. I have enough to just be like, to comfortably summon, and I also have a lot, a lot of stuff in, like, back order, I guess, is the nice way of saying it. I have a lot of Wormite that I haven't touched because it's the secret stash. Um, so I'm not gonna be like a lot of people who immediately get zero Wormite and they can't do anything. I also don't plan to get below, um, 35,000 or so. So, 36,000, I think. So, we're not going to be going that crazy. So, I started with some single tickets, and now I'm going to transition into doing some um, um, singles before I go into the multi. Just because at this point I've done some singles, so I may as well finish it out. You will notice that this also is a prize showcase, but I think prize showcases lose a lot of luster if you don't have free multis to go with them. And currently, this event doesn't have any free multis, so I think that's a you know missed opportunity. Dragalia has been really stingy with a lot of their stuff recently. I've noticed it. Um, a lot of people have noticed it, actually. And have been correctly kind of going like, Hey, yo, what's up with that, man? That's not cool. I think it's way harder now to kind of uh, destroy your entire stash for one character and then rebuild it. Because it used to be that I could easily get 30,000 after not summoning for like like one banner i would miss one banner and i would get like twenty thousand. and with this i was barely able to get five thousand wormite it seems like it's kind of getting that point where it's like man they gave us a pity system and then they said well gonna take away this now <laughs> you don't need it and it's like oh well the pity system isn't that good 300 summons is still a lot and i don't know if you know this but if you actually whale in the game and you use the diamonds um, it's actually less summons. It's 150, I think. Um, because when you do a summon with, um, diamonds, it costs, um, it's treated as if you did, like, two, um, two summons instead of one. So if you did uh, 150 paid summons, it's less than doing 300, um, stuff you collected. Which is actually kind of nice, because I always thought diamonds were kind of useless. <laughs> Except for when you're buying, like, um... What's the thing you're buying? When you're buying the dream ticket, that's the only time I've ever found um, diamonds useful is for buying the dream ticket. And that is still in the, I've only bought the dream ticket once. Um, and that one time I bought it, um, it was worth it because I got grace with it. But there's really not a lot of reasons to buy diamonds in my experience from what I've seen. But maybe that's gonna change now, you know? The game's a little bit more um, it saps away your Wormite and tickets way faster now, so maybe there is some merit to using diamonds now. I don't know. I'm personally not using it. By the way, this is looking very bad so far. 
This is a very bad set of summons. Let's see this one multi. Can I get all three characters in one multi, please? That'd be great. Um, and if you're wondering um, where Cleo is, she's actually the event character. Weird, right? We're doing a collab with another place that is, one, not limited. So there's honestly not a lot of reason for you to summon on this. Um, I guess we'll see if it fakes out. Um, but what's the other word I was looking for? Um, fake out... But also the collab unit in general is a, um, not from a co- it's like really weird that it's just Cleo. I mean, I like Cleo. I, <laughs> I'm honestly a little bit more happy to get the free Cleo than I am to get anything else, but it is weird. It was, this entire collab has felt very weird to me. Um, but I guess it's better for them to make a skippable collab, because you can just get the girl at any time and you get Cleo for free, so really what's the point? And it's not like a lot of these characters are, at least from the early tests I've seen, but it's reading what they do, they don't seem broken. So they seem perfectly fine. Some people are out there saying like they're the worst characters out there, and I don't think that's true. Are they not as good as some other collab units? Sure. Um, I would actually consider them on par with a lot of them. Some people are considered like, of like when they mention good collab units, they mean like, oh, like Marth and Veronica, and then I say, they have mana spirals. <laughs> of course, they're gonna be better. <laughs> don't don't go crazy now. Don't forget that Marth and Veronica were very bad until they got their mana spiral. When they launched, they were fantastic units, but now, hmm, now they're amazing. There was like a specific drop period. I think I want to say um, Veronica lasted up until Galaclea's release. I think. Then once Galaclea came out, there was just no reason to have um, her whatsoever. It felt like. Uh, and Marth, he just felt bad to the time, tales of time. But then once they got the Mana Spiral, they were way better. They're better now, for sure. Alphonse, too. I, I didn't mention Alphonse at all, but he's pretty solid from what I remember. But yeah, in terms of, like, when I think of Krom, and I think of, um, you know, Krom might be technically stronger than them. We'll have to wait and see. Stronger than her, I should say, because she's the only collab, technically, from another world. It's not like even like they're Princess Cleo and Princess Mitsube. They are foragers. <laughs> they just found some food. Ooh, gold prize. Thank you. And silver prize. Cool. What'd I get? Ooh! Nice. I don't mind that. I don't mind that at all. Alright, get into this again. Um... No real luck so far. And it's looking like I'm not gonna get lucky at all. I was hoping that I would already get my five break, but it looks like that ain't happening anytime soon. Let's see. I'm also not skipping these codes so I can look at them and remember, this, this is for everyone. You should not some, ooh. If I get Pandora, I can just stop summoning. Come on, Pandora. Bounty rush, bring the bounty rush look. My medals have been upgraded and guess what? I'm looking for Pandora. My dog is named Pandora, which is why I want Pandora the most out of all the units on the banner. Come on. Wow. Uh-huh. Hello. Hello, unicorn. Hello. I forget your name. You look very, very beautiful, though, and your boobs are humongous! There you go! Yeah! Alright, I think I can stop summoning now. I really just wanted Pandora because she's named after my dog. <laughs> so that works for me perfectly. Alright everyone, good luck if you're actually summoning. Um, again, that's where I'm stopping because I got one of the characters on it. I, want, I got the character I wanted most so I'm dipping out. I hope to pull um, Pecoron. Oh, wait, how do you say that name again? Pecorine, okay, I don't know why I keep saying it wrong. Pecorine, um, I wish you good luck, uh, but this is this is where I stop my summons. So until next time, everyone, I wish you the best of luck. Um, I'll, that video of the data mines will come out a little bit later, probably right before I go to bed, because that's when I like to release some videos. And until next time, everyone, you guys have a good day, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace out. Bye-bye.